Hey everybody, welcome to King Tech. I'm your host, Corey. Uh, this is our first episode, so excited to be here. Um, today, you're gonna get to know me a little bit. We're gonna talk about what's in my bag. And this right here is my bag, obviously. So, this is the Tumi Tahoe bag. Um, I got this about a few months ago, and it's been an amazing bag so far. Um, we're gonna just take our time and go through the features of the bag and show you what's in it. So, let's go. All right. So, first off, we'll talk the outside of the bag, obviously. Um, like I said, this is a Tumi bag. Um, this one doesn't have a whole lot of branding on it. I do, however, have my initials on it. Um, right there, CRK, for those who don't know. Uh, but yeah, so, love this bag to death so far. Um, lots of features. Uh, for anybody that does know Tumi bags, the, the great thing about them is, and probably the best feature most people say, is the Tumi tracer. Um, that's right here inside this compartment of the bag. And basically what that allows you to do is, um, Tumi can trace this bag to anywhere in the world. Um, it has a serial number and a barcode in there. Um, it's like sold into the bag. So if you lose this bag in an airport, you lose it anywhere, they can find it for you. Um, and that's like I said, one of the main features of the bag and why a lot of professionals carry it because you're carrying documents or you know expensive camera equipment or expensive laptops, they can find your bag for you and hopefully you can recover whatever was lost or stolen. So, very important. Um, also, about a good feature about the bag is just the build quality. Um, everything built very well, really comfy. Um, I love the way the bag looks on my back. Um, I feel like that's really important for me. So, you can see here, great looking bag. Um, next up, Sticking with just the features of the bag, um, a great thing about this bag as well is the bottom part here has this water resistant cover that comes out the bottom of it. So you can cover up the entire bag here and keep everything inside of it nice and dry. Um, and it has the Tumi emblem on there as well. So great feature, awesome to have. Don't want your tech getting wet. All right, next up, sticking with the back of the bag as well, we have this little sleeve here. And basically what this allows you to do is put this bag on a suitcase and just wheel it around. You don't have to carry the bag through the airport or anything like that. It's great when you're traveling. Um, it's just an awesome feature as well. Next up, we have this back compartment here that's a little hidden compartment where you can just, you know, slide little things into if you're on the go. You know, you're at the airport, you can just, you know, slide your phone, slide your charger in there, you know, get up and go. So, great features there as well. Um, next up on the front, we have another little sleeve here. And this sleeve I usually keep maybe a granola bar or something in, or a charger. Like I said, I just slip things in. But right now, it is holding my phone of choice at the current moment. This is the OnePlus 7 Pro. Uh, great phone, great cameras, great, just a speedy phone. We'll go through this a little bit later in another episode, but this is currently what I'm using. Hopefully, next will be the uh, Galaxy Note 10. So next, let's just start going through the bag. Um, we have a lot of compartments here. We have several on the front. We have a couple side compartments here. Um, I usually don't keep a whole lot in here. I might throw my keys in there when I'm on the go. But back to this compartment here that has this Tumi tracer. Um, another great thing about this one is it has this keychain holder. And I usually keep um, some things for work, my keys, as well as these headphones here. These are the Anchor Soundcore headphones. I use these for working out. They're great, they're water resistant, sweat resistant, all that great stuff. Uh, and they're around the ear. They're the around the ear headphones. So they're great to just, you know, throw on. They're, they're stable. Uh, they have the different ear cups you can uh, fix with it. So great headphones, love these. Had them for about a year now. Uh, they're like 30 bucks using on Amazon, so good price, good quality. Next, we'll go over here to this next compartment here. And this is where I usually keep charging cables. Um, so in here, I have my charging cable for my Surface tablet here. Um, I always keep that with me in my bag, usually we're using it to record right now. But it keep, I keep that in there so I can always get work done on the go. Um, if I wanna watch movies, it has Netflix, all that kind of stuff on there. So it's a great tablet to keep around. I've had it for a number of years now. Also up here in this little compartment, I have some, I have a watch band that I can change out on my watch. 
Um, this is the wash band I usually wear when I'm working out or if I'm going swimming or something like that. This wash band, rubberized, so good to keep them around for when you're gonna be sweating or anything like that. Next, I have my Jackery portable charger, uh, 20,100 milliamp hour charger. This will, this will charge your phone up more than a few times. Great, nice construction, metal. Um, and then for those Android folks, it has the Qualcomm char Quick Charge 3.0, so you can charge your phone up just like that. Uh, it's a great charger. I've had this for a number of years now as well. Um, you can see it has some nicks and bruises on it, but it's gotten the job done as well. Next over here in the bag, let's see what else we got. Ah, my favorite charging cable. So this is a charging cable I got off of Amazon as well. I get a lot of stuff from Amazon as you can see. But uh, this is braided, it's good quality, six, six foot cable, USB type C. Um, and then it has these like leather accents, you know, clasps, you can unravel it, clasp it back. Uh, great for keeping things in cable management, always important. So that's pretty much it for this section over here. Now we can move on to the main compartment of the book bag. And this is where you can keep any of your bigger items. Um, so in here I will have, let's see, first up, I have a book. I'm currently reading the autobiography of Malcolm X. So that's always with me. It's taking me a little while to read it, but hopefully I'll get that finished soon. Uh, next up, I have the Bose Soundcore speaker. Um, this is actually my roommate's, so don't tell him. I steal it quite often, you know, gotta keep the party going. So that's in there. Uh, then last but not least is my handy dandy notebook. Uh, I take a lot of notes in here, things about the channel, things about what I want to accomplish. Uh, it's just a great thing to keep around. So love this little notebook there as well. Um, and then just taking a look inside this main compartment here, it's just it's wide open. I uh, hope you can see that. It's wide open so you can, you know, put camera gear in there, whatever you need to put in there. It has plenty of space. This lap, this uh, tablet sleeve here is where I normally keep my Surface tablet as well as the Surface Pen. So that's mainly everything on this bag. We have one little section left, which is probably my favorite. Um, this is technically a laptop bag, so it has this back apartment here that will hold a laptop, obviously. So in here I have my work laptop, Dell. Um, this is a 15 inch laptop and it's not thin by any means so it definitely will hold any size tablet i mean any size laptop that you need it to um, plenty of space back there opens up wide so you can get in there and cook access and then it also has another compartment down there as well so plenty of space to have this book bag you can definitely cram a lot more stuff than what i have in here um, but this is a very everyday book bag i carry it everywhere i go so that's my bag thanks for joining us we'll see you next time Bye, Tom.